So a couple of things, other things that we want to talk about with geckos is, and we mentioned it earlier, is the loss of their habitat. Now most animals, they live in places that even people haven't discovered yet, but when they do, the first thing that most people like to do is they like to build a home, or they like to build something there, and when they're doing that, they're actually destroying the animal's habitat. And a lot of animals are getting pushed into smaller and smaller and smaller areas, and if we have that happening, some animals are going they might be going extinct, they might become in danger, and we don't want that to happen. One animal that actually does, or most of these animals do have that occurring to their homes. Now, in Sandy's hand right now, can't remember which school asked it, but you asked, what is the largest gecko? And you are staring at the species. This specific gecko is not the largest one in the world, but this type of gecko, these are the largest ones in the world. And Sandy's going to talk to you guys about it. This is called the New Caledonian Giant Gecko. It's the largest species, as uh, Michael had mentioned. Now these guys will eat the insects as well, but they also love to eat flowers, stick their head and get some nice fruity pollen. Now this guy's a little overweight, so I have not want to die eating that you. baby food that we had mentioned. Uh, but these guys can lose their tail as well as a defense mechanism. They won't really grow back properly like some of the other species. 